Are you itching to dive into the realm of Amazon selling or seeking savvy techniques to skyrocket your sales? If that's a resounding yes, then you already know that securing a top spot on Amazon's first page is an absolute game changer. But how can you rank on that coveted page one and attract more customers to your products? Well, the secret sauce is all in the optimization of your Amazon product listings with the right keywords. By strategizing incorporating highly relevant keywords into your product descriptions, titles and tags, you can capture the attention of potential customers and improve your chances of ranking on page one. Hello everyone, I'm Ankita Patil, Product Evangelist at SellerUp and today I'm going to show you how to do keyword research on Amazon. Well, our highlight feature of the day is SellerUp's Keyword Tool. This tool skims through megabytes of data points to pull the most relevant keywords for your niche. Also, it helps you to discover which keywords drive the most traffic for your competitor listing and implement them into your listings. For our top three channel subscribers, we have a free six month seller app subscription plan worth of $450. Exciting, isn't it? So find the link to the seller app keyword tool in the comment section below. Well, here's a quick overview of the topics we are covering in this video. Before we begin, if you find this video helpful, click the like button below and subscribe to SellerApp so you don't miss out on more exciting Amazon selling tutorials in the future. And don't forget to follow us on our social media channels. Let's get started. What is Amazon keyword research and why is it important? So keyword research involves identifying the right search terms used by customers when looking for products on Amazon. By integrating these relevant keywords into your product listings and ads, you can enhance your product's visibility and increase its ranking in Amazon search results. This can lead to higher traffic, more organic sales and ultimately a healthier business with reduced ad spend and lower marketing cost. Let me show you something interesting. So these are the keyword trends for the tracked keywords which you will find in the seller app's product intelligence feature. If you wish to add high converting keywords to your listings and advertising, stay tuned to this video. So how do you conduct Amazon keyword research? If you want to succeed on Amazon, you need to play by the book. But you also should play it smart, right? This video shows how to conduct keyword research the right way. The goal is to create a thorough list of keywords for each product. This will help you maximize the number of search queries that trigger your product listings, making your product more visible in the Amazon search results. Well, here's how. Step 1. Understand your buyer's personas. Say for example, you are selling kitchen towels. So start by identifying the type of customers who are likely to be interested in purchasing your product based on the factors such as the gender, age, interests, the pain points, approximate income, what motivates them to purchase your kitchen towels. You should tailor this list to your specific category and product. By creating buyer personas, you can more effectively generate relevant and targeted keywords that are most likely used by potential buyers and their interests. Step 2. Decide on your seed keywords. You are now at the very start of your Amazon keyword research journey. Open up an Excel spreadsheet and start by listing all the keywords that come to your mind. If you were describing what your product is in your own words, so you can grow your keyword list by starting with seed keywords. So it's really important to get it right. Don't overcomplicate it though. Just list the words that describe what you are selling. And that's it. Step three, generate keyword ideas using Amazon keyword tool. Now comes the fun part. It's time to develop that initial 
brainstormed list. What better than incorporating keyword research tool into your approach? Let me take you to the easiest Amazon keyword research journey with the Cellwrap keyword tool. On the Cellwrap platform, navigate to the keyword tool. Under this, we have two sub features. Let's look into each one of them in detail. First is keyword research. It will help you to find the keyword opportunities for your listings. In this, you can enter any keyword. I'm entering table. You'll see that the search results will be displayed on the screen. On the left, you will find the relevant keywords to the entered keyword. Also, you can find tags against these keywords. So they depict the current trend of these keywords on Amazon. And on the right, we have all the metrics based on which these keywords can be evaluated. Additionally, you can track the keywords where you will be directed towards keyword targeting under product intelligence feature. There, you can analyze them better for a specific period of time. And if they are good to go, then add them to advertising right in. So within a few clicks, you can add more relevant keywords to your advertising. You can export the data with this tab and copy paste the most relevant keywords list into a new sheet in your Excel spreadsheet. I have been interacting with many Amazon sellers and they have this very problem that whenever a customer searches for a keyword relevant to their product, the competitor's listing appears to be at the top. And this is kind of frustrating after uh, putting in so many efforts, your competitors are ranking at the top of the Amazon search. Now imagine how cool would it be if we could actually understand the keyword strategies of your competitors and accordingly invite them into your listings. Interesting, right? And that is where reverse ASIN tool comes into picture. Here you can compare your ASIN with your competitors ASIN. I have added two ASINs and now click on compare. The best part about this tool is at a time you can compare your ASIN with three other competitors ASINs. You'll see that the search results will be already displayed on the screen. On the left, you'll find the keywords which are present in your ASIN as well as your competitor's ASIN. And on the right, we can see the metrics used to evaluate the keywords. Now, this is your ASIN and this is your competitor's ASIN. If you consider this example, the search term has good estimated orders per month and even the conversion rate but it's present in your competitor's ASIN and not in yours. This can be that keyword which is helping them to rank at the top of the Amazon SOAPs. So you can directly add them to advertising or if you want, you can track them down further uh, to keywords tracking, you'll be directed. And under that, uh, you can actually analyze them for a specific period of time. And if you feel that they're worth it, then you can just add them to your advertising. So this is how convenient this tool is to use. Within a few clicks, you can understand the keyword strategies your competitors are using and accordingly use them into your ads. Step four, generate keyword ideas using Amazon Autofill. The basic step to begin your keyword research is Amazon Autofill. You can find additional keyword suggestions using this autofill option to determine how popular your product is, you can begin your research by entering your seed keyword into the search bar on Amazon.com. So Amazon will then provide you with a series of suggested search terms based on what other users have searched for in relation to the seed keyword. So to ensure that you don't miss any potential keywords, follow your seed keyword with A to C and note down any relevant search terms. Of record these keywords in a separate spreadsheet and give it a name. Step five, generate keyword ideas using Google Keyword Planner. Yes, I know that what you are thinking. Why Keyword Planner when we need to optimize for Amazon A9? So optimizing for both Amazon and Google algorithms can help you increase your product rankings on both platforms. So if your listings are optimized for Google, chances are high that your products would rank on Google for relevant search terms as well. So if you have a Google AdWords account, you can use the Google Keyword Planner to 
provide additional keyword suggestions based on your initial search terms. Simply create another new sheet based in the keywords you find and give the sheet a name. Step 6. Generate keywords from existing campaigns. You can easily find low A cost and high sales generating keywords from campaigns through SellerApp's Advertising Insights feature. On the SellerApp platform, navigate to Advertising and then Insights. Under this, we have positive search terms. On the left, you'll see the search terms which are performing well for your campaigns. And on the right, you can see the primary attributes, performance metrics and the derived metrics. So this will help you to determine which of the search terms are performing exceptionally well for your campaigns. Step 7. Generate keywords from Amazon Search Query Performance Reports. Amazon Search Query Performance Report is a powerful tool that can help sellers find the top converting keywords for their product. This report provides valuable information about the search queries the customers use to find the products on Amazon. So by analyzing this report, sellers can identify the most relevant and profitable keywords for their products and optimize their ads and listings accordingly. Step 8. Create your master Amazon keyword list. It's time to compile all the keywords you have identified to a single list. Remember to go through the list and eliminate any duplicates. To accomplish this, select all the keywords and click on data. Later on, on data cleanup and then remove duplicates. Then select the column you want to remove the duplicates from and click on OK. After that, you will need to go through the list again to eliminate any irrelevant keywords. So this may take some time, but it's a crucial step that shouldn't be rushed. And just like that, you'll have a lengthy list of highly relevant Amazon search terms that are frequently searched for. Step 9. Segmenting your keyword ideas. When building a list of master keywords, it's important to evaluate which ones have the best potential and should be prioritized. So to do this, you should segment the search terms into three categories, primary keywords, secondary keywords, and backing keywords. Now, primary keywords are the most important search terms that will drive the most value to your business and should be prioritized in your listings and advertising campaigns. Next is secondary keywords. These are relevant but not core to your products and should be included where appropriate. So backend keywords are relevant to your products but may not be worth adding to your listing and should be added to the backend product editor for the ASIN. This can include misspellings, synonyms and other related terms that customers might use to search for a product. Once you have determined the main keywords to target, you'll need to decide how to use them effectively to rank for those terms. Now, how to use your target keywords? Well, Amazon ranks products based on how effectively it believes they will sell. And to signal that, your products are a good match for what shoppers are looking for. There are two main ways to use keywords on Amazon, in product listings and also in advertising. So for product listings, keywords should be incorporated into the title, bullet points, description and backend keywords. This helps ensure that your product appears in the relevant search results when customers are browsing on Amazon. In addition to adding uh, your keywords to your listings, it's also important to use them in your PPC campaigns. So when creating a paid ad campaign, you can select the search terms to target with your ads. And by adding your target keywords, you can ensure that your products appear on the results page for those searches. Although you will need to pay each time someone clicks on your ads, this is an effective way to get targeted visitors to your listings while you wait to rank organically on the keywords. So using keywords to optimizing your product listings. So after compiling a relevant list of keywords, it's time to use them effectively. When you are optimizing your product listings, you will want to incorporate as many of your keywords as possible. Make sure you don't repeat those keywords 
Amazon A9 will only display your listing for queries that are an exact match for your keywords. The product title is the most crucial location to include your keywords because it carries the most weightage according to Amazon A9. So however, all aspects of your listing optimization are essential if you hope to enhance your ranking. Tune in to the detailed guide on how to optimize your Amazon product listings in the description. Now that you optimized your listings with relevant keywords, don't leave it at that. There are a few best practices you should do to ensure that your keyword research is successful. Check if you're indexing for all relevant keywords. Check whether your ASINs are indexed. To make sure your ASINs are being indexed for all the search terms you have identified, there's a quick way you can check using Cellwrap's keyword tracking and index checker features. Now, next comes is very important that is track keyword rankings. Uh, keeping an eye on your product keyword rankings and SEO performance, this will definitely help you determine if your optimization efforts and PPC strategies are yielding results. So if you discover that your ranking for your target keywords is poor, you can make changes to your listings to enhance your rankings or you could run ads for these keywords to improve visibility. When running PPC campaigns, tracking keywords can help you identify the most effective keywords to target. By monitoring which keywords are driving the most clicks and conversions, you can optimize your ad campaigns by adjusting your bid strategy and focusing on the keywords that are most likely to result in sales. Furthermore, it's possible to track your competitors' keywords or those of a top selling product or seller using keyword tracking offered by Sellera. Having the right set of keywords can do wonders for your business as it can attract loyal customers to your product listings. By implementing an effective Amazon keyword research strategy and using the right Amazon keyword tool, you can make your products more visible to valuable prospects. Follow these crucial steps to incorporate highly relevant keywords in your listing for generating sales and profits in the fiercely competitive Amazon marketplace. And that's it for this video, everyone. Thanks for watching. Your support means a lot to us. It encourages us to bring out more helpful videos like this. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe to Sellera. Let us know if you guys want us to create detailed seller guides on any specific topics. You can leave your suggestions in the comment section below and we'll definitely create them for you. And don't forget to follow us on our social media channels for more helpful content. If you haven't already, click the bell icon so that you will never miss another video. And as always, happy selling!